stories of odd and eccentric school teachers. I remember back when I was in high school, I had a school teacher that was obsessed with pigs, so much so that her entire classroom was decorated in various pig merchandise. She even told us that someday she wanted to buy a car shaped like a pig. I wonder if she ever actually bought it. But I would guess that few of us have had teachers that would go so far as to build their own spooky fantasy castle. But right here in Canada, that's exactly what happened. This is the story of the very strange and the very cool Midlothian castle. North of Toronto, on the edge of reality, screaming heads and odd sculptures rise from the hills. If one did not know any better, they may think that they had just entered some ancient esoteric alien landscape. In actuality, this is the town of Berks Falls. This massive art installation is the creation of artist and former teacher Peter Kamani. Mr. Kamani would attend the University of Waterloo and graduate with a bachelor's in art. He would then become an art teacher at the Elmaguen Highlands Secondary School. In the year 1981, he would begin working on the Midlothian Castle. In 2008, he would retire from teaching, now focusing entirely on his artistic ambitions. Each piece of art on the property was made with a purpose. The screaming heads, when viewed from above, formed the shape of a dragon. Dotted throughout the property are huge steel sculptures. These sculptures are used for the Burke Falls Annual Harvest Festival, which is held every September. During the festival, cloth is placed over the sculptures, giving the appearance of crashed spaceships and pyramids. I started in 1989 and I've uh, progressed every summer uh, since then. I started on the, the house which resembles the castle. It was meant to be like a primitive cave. Uh, early uh, human beings lived in caves, so I decided I'd build my own cave and I did uh, cave paintings on the inside. It's similar to the, the Druids with their idea of the good and the bad, uh, a right and left, uh, a du duality. The Midlothian Castle an art piece that is sometimes called the Stonehenge of Ontario is a beautiful piece of art and self-expression. It's concreted itself as a permanent part of the culture of Burke's Falls. It attracts visitors from all over the world, and it's truly a magical place. The amazing Midlothian Castle and the artist Peter Kamani will never be forgotten. Almost taste the bitter cup. We found as we went deep in the underbrush.
You know, I really gotta hand it to the artist. This place is pretty cool. Hands up, this is a robbery. Oh no, please don't hurt us. Don't worry, give me all your money and everything will be just fine, okay?